Hey, how are you doing? During the past few weeks, I've been helping a lot of people in our Slimpod community to take control of stress. And I've had so many messages from people saying that they didn't realise just how much of an impact stress has on the immune system and the huge impact it has on our health. Many didn't realise how stress drives you to eat more too. A lot of people use food as a coping mechanism and right now I reckon that particular problem is at an all-time high. And of course, when we're stressed, it often goes hand in hand with sleepless nights. Our brains are just too active and we just can't switch off. Sleep is super important to our overall health and well-being and lack of sleep can affect us in so many ways, including our fitness and our weight. Poor sleep affects your well-being more than you might think. A lack of sleep makes you feel tired and lethargic and it does the same thing to your fat cells, making your body far less effective at breaking down fatty tissues. If you're sleep deprived, your brain gets more excited when it sees unhealthy food. And it's not just your weight that's affected if you don't sleep properly, it really affects your stress levels and can lead to depression. So this needs to stop right now. Our routines are totally disrupted right now too, and we don't realise how much of an effect that has. Some of us are working from our bedrooms every day too, which also means it's so difficult to switch off. So here are four major tips on how to get better sleep. One, think about your nighttime routine. Do you check Facebook before you go to bed? Research shows that people who were on social media two hours before going to bed had poor sleep. 70% of people check Facebook before going to bed. I used to do that too, but I found myself being drawn in and just getting wound up about something that people had posted. So I just stopped and it's been so liberating. Number two, has your evening routine been disrupted recently? Be really aware of this. What was it like before? It may be that the kids went to bed earlier than they do now and that's disrupted your sleep pattern too. Number three, do something soothing an hour or so before you go to bed. Meditate or do some yoga in the evening, something that's away from technology. And four, use your chill pod. You can listen to this any time of the night, so if you wake up, put it on again. And if you haven't got one for some reason, the link is below. It's usually part of the SlimPod program because it helps people to stop eating in response to stress. But if you're not on my program, then please grab yourself a free chill pod below and do share one with your friends too. It's more than a meditation or relaxation download. It works in a very deep way to help you control stress. Again, please do share. I'd love to spread the love right now.